So hi, my dear friends. This is a third try of uh, recording an uh, interview with my uh, friend and we are having some technical problems because we are on a different part of the world. I hope that this time that things will work out. So, you know, in life, it's like in a business, you try and you do things until you succeed it. So we'll see, uh, will this third try uh, bring us, you know, success. So before uh, my friend Kevin join us, uh, I would like to uh, tell you why I'm doing this and wh why are these secrets of success important. So I decided to add value to your life and help you to be more successful. And that's why I'm bringing highly successful entrepreneurs from all over the world to give some tips, advices, and their experiences on success. So today, I really hope that we will, uh, that we will be able uh, to have uh, Coach Kevin. Kevin is also a really good friend of mine uh, on our Facebook Live. So thank you for joining. I see some people are joining. Um, yeah, Steffi is here. Uh, Drew, hi Drew. Thank you for being here. Um, yeah, let's see. Okay. I think we're gonna make it. So, uh, let's, let's wait a few seconds. Let's wait a few seconds and let's see, is this thing working? So, okay. Okay, okay. So, Steffi, hi, Steffi. How are you spending your day, Drew? Hello, Drew. Who just joined us? Please say hi. We really, uh, I really appreciate it. You know, it's like when so coming to someone's house, you are. Uh... So, hello. Hello, Kevin. How are you, Sylvia? <laughs> oh, I'm good. I'm so happy to see you. <laughs> uh, good to see you, my friend. Good to see you. Sorry for the little bit of technical difficulties. I don't know what's going on, but Thank you, Kevin. I was just commenting. I don't know. Did you heard? I said, this is like in life. It's like in a business. We try and we do things until we uh, succeed sit in it. So we made it. Absolutely. You know, it, it usually never works out on the first time. So you try and try and try again. Absolutely. So thanks for having yes, me. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Heaven, for giving us your time. And uh, we know each other personally, and I have a privilege to know a lot of things about you, your successes. But would you be so kind to, to tell the people who maybe don't know you yet, what is it you actually do? Well, that's, that, that's a great question. So um, I, am the, I started a company about 10 years ago. It's called Momentum Consulting Group. We are a global organization where we work with entrepreneurs to large businesses, uh, grow and expand their business. If, uh, if you're an entrepreneur, we put the foundational building blocks in place so people can actually grow and mm -hmm. then exceed you know, their wildest expectations. If you're a corporation or a company that's already established, we work mm -hmm. with you to take you to the next level. So, uh, and we work with all sorts of, you know, whether you're, like I said, whether you're an entrepreneur, whether you're a corporate, it doesn't really matter. Businesses has the same foundations. It doesn't matter what industry you're in because there's things that we have to do in our business to grow. And it doesn't matter if you're uh, one of the Fortune 50 to starting out a business. And so, mm -hmm. yeah, so it's fun. I, I, enjoy, I love what I do. Yes, and, and, and I can tell that, Kevin, because uh, not just because now we are doing this interview, I had a, also a chance to meet you, to learn from you, and to be coached by you, and your knowledge and experience is really amazing. And Kevin, uh, I know that we don't have so much time today, and that's why I want to you know, take the best out of you. And tell me, I'm really curious about one thing. We can learn a lot from the books, from the speeches and from the content that it's all, you know, on the Internet, in the books. But not so many people are talking about failures, about mistakes, about the wrong steps. So would you be so kind to share maybe stories? What were your failures? Wow. I don't know if we have enough time to talk about all my failures. <laughs> but, uh, uh, there's certainly a lot of them. And... You know, one of the things I, you know, prior to starting Momentum, I had built other companies. I was the CEOs of other companies. And I had figured that just because I had done this, people would automatically come 
to me at moment um, at momentum and mm -hmm. you know that's really not the case and what i would encourage everyone listening is we have relationship capital everywhere around us and i figured okay i start a business i open a website people will come well it doesn't work that way and mm -hmm. uh and so i sat for many months i mean i was busy but i was not busy with clients and it took me i had to really utilize the relationship capital that 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 is in all of our networks and let people know that you are doing whatever venture you are doing and see i didn't do that i figured okay mm -hmm. i've done this i'm, I'm re i relied on my past to you know have my future and i would tell you that's not a good way to do that and so when i started tapping into the resources around me and the people around me and just 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 having a conversation and say hey did you know i started a consulting firm and then i helped businesses mm -hmm. grow and uh, they said no i didn't have any idea i wondered what happened to you well you know i i was my own worst enemy because i kept this very quiet even though i didn't realize i was keeping it quiet so mm -hmm. i would encourage everyone to tap into your network let people know what you're doing and 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 deliver value to them in in such a way that they you know gravitate towards you and they want to do business with you and so mm -hmm. that's what i did and, and that's what we continue to do every every day here at momentum mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this is amazing tip kevin and and tell me uh did you have any special mentor at that time? Uh, how did you become aware of that the mistake that you did, you actually did? Yeah, well, I had a mentor, but I really didn't uh, think of him as a mentor, uh, as a business coach, actually. Um, mm -hmm. He was a good friend of mine. And, uh, um, but then I, I really realized that, you know, getting uh, an executive advisor, a business coach, uh, lots of different names for him, if you mm -hmm. get surround yourself with people and I have to still surround myself with people, we all do with people that are, are thinking about things that we're not thinking about that have experienced things that we have not crossed that road yet. And so it's, it's, it's highly important because mm -hmm. uh, it doesn't matter where you are in your walk of life. I know some very powerful, very affluent people in this world and they have mentors and because there's, there's always someone or a group of people that, are exceeding at a different rate. And uh, so surround yourself with really good people and uh, they will take you amazing places. But we have to mm. let them know what we're doing. And uh, uh, I would say if, we're, if, if we want to be quiet about what we're doing, you know, join the, the CIA. But, and, and that's not <laughs> what I wanted to do. Uh, but uh, I, I figured I open a website, people will come because they know me and they know what my past accomplishments were. But that's not how life works. You have to constantly mm -hmm. keep reaching out and educating. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you said it amazing, Kevin. And, and one thing that I know as well, you are traveling all over the world and you do have opportunity to meet different people. So that's why I just want to take this uh, second of our time to welcome everyone who's watching this, who joined us live, who decided, invested this time and hear uh, valuable words from Kevin because only one word can change the whole life. I remember, Kevin, when, when we met first time, you, you said the sentence that changed my life, that made me start my uh, businesses now. And today I'm just published in an international magazine thanks to wow. that sentence. So thank you. Thank you for that, Kevin. That's awesome. Is Congratulations. Thank you. Is there anything, I know we are short with time, and uh, is there anything else that you would, you know, give us some, some tip for the end uh, uh, about the failure maybe? Yeah, you know, it's, we've all heard the saying, fail forward, right? And mm -hmm. I would tell each and every one of us, and I have to remind myself that we have to continue to press on. Um, Coach or Nito uh, Kubain would say, hey, it takes about 10,000 hours to build a business. Mm -hmm. And so it's easy to get discouraged. I thought, you know, I built multi-million dollar organizations, one after another, after another, into the hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars. And I thought, I don't understand why people aren't, you know, gravitating toward me. And that wasn't an ego thing. 
It was just, I, thought, <laughs> I don't get it. I can't, I'm, I build all these other businesses, but why can't I build my own? But I wasn't using the people around me. And, you know, it's all about persistence. And I wouldn't be speaking to you today if it wasn't about persistence. And mm -hmm. we will be told no more than we will be told yes. But, you know, I believe that uh, God has a way of working in our lives that, you know, that strengthens us, that wants us to excel. And he wants us to, to, to uh, you know, we, we were never promised an easy life. We were promised yes. a life well lived if we live a well life and, uh, and we live a, a life that is uh, a believed life. So um, I just tell people, be persistent, stay focused, uh, mm -hmm. deliver value, be relentless and go after your dreams. And if you do that um, in time, things will manifest and opportunities will come into your life. You'll see things that you never saw before that were always there. And it happens to me just about every day. And all of a sudden, we capitalize on those opportunities. And, and, but it's, I'm telling you, I've been told no more than I was told yes. And all of a sudden, when I was told a yes, I thought, did they just say yes? <laughs> and so uh, <laughs> it's, it's about persistence. So persistence yes. pays off. Yeah, definitely. Coach Karen, I agree 100% with you, what you just said. I also heard more no in my life than yes. But um, it's a sweet taste when, when, when you hear that, yes, and you know how hard you work for that. Uh, Kevin, thank you so much for, uh, for this time. Uh, and if I may, I would like to share and invite information, invite all my friends. Uh, next month, Coach Kevin will be with us. So stay, stay on my channel, Coach Kevin. Thank you so much. I know that uh, this, is, this was valuable for me, even though I heard you talking about this, but every time it's like you remind me again how important it is to go for it, to be focused, to, you know, to be persistent, even when we hear that no, because every no comes yes if we don't give up. Thank you so Absolutely. much. You're welcome. You know, I have a, I'll, I'll end with saying this. I have a plaque here in my office that says, and you've heard me say this, Focus on the important, not on the urgent. And so it doesn't always come in our time frame, but if you focus on what's important and do it with so much passion and so much conviction, you will get to where you want to be. So thank you for having wow. me. Wow. <laughs> thank you, Kevin. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye now. So, my dear friends, uh, that was amazing, uh, Kevin E. Friends. So you heard just a part of the story. Uh, Kevin is an amazing, amazing coach. I know him now for a few years already. I met him through an amazing uh, uh, organization, JT Fox organization, where we uh, had experience of getting to know each other. So. I hope that this, what we shared today, what Coach Kevin said, and my experience as well, will help you to become more successful. If you're a solopreneur, it can be hard, it can be tough, you know, sometimes the books are not the enough or motivational videos. You need to surround yourself with a highly successful people. So that's why stay in my, uh, stay in my Facebook, uh, connect with me, connect with Coach Kevin. Uh, if you want to bring your business to the next level, uh, people like Coach Kevin definitely know how to help you with that. Thank you, Steffi. Thank you, Sonia, uh, Christina, Diana, Renata. Thank you, uh, Tamara. Um, uh, who is uh, Ibrahim? If I miss someone, uh, please, uh, yeah, Abi Sheikh is here. So thank you for giving your time. Uh, have a beautiful day. Don't give up on your dreams. You have important mission because your life is important and we are here to support you. Love you guys and speak to you soon. Bye bye. <laughs>